Starline. Clarice Ann. Good morning. Good morning, Mr. Crawford. Sorry to pull you off the course at such short notice. Your instructors tell me you're doing well. Top quarter of your class. I hope so. They haven't posted any grades yet. A job's come up, and I thought about you. You're not a job, really. More of an interesting errand. Sit down. Yes, sir. I remember you from my seminar at UVA. <laughs> You grilled me pretty hard, as I recall, on the Bureau's civil rights record in the Hoover years. I gave you an A. A minus, sir. Let's see. Double major, psych and criminology, graduated in Magna, summer internships at the Reisinger Clinic. It says here, when you graduate, you want to come to work for me in behavioral science. Yes, very much, sir. Very much. We're interviewing all the serial killers now in custody for a psychobehavioral profile. Could be a real help in unsolved cases. Most of them have been happy to talk to us. You spook easily, Starling? Not yet, sir. See, the one we want most refuses to cooperate. I want you to go after him again today in the asylum. And who's the subject? The psychiatrist, Hannibal Lecter. Hannibal the cannibal. I don't expect him to talk to you. But I have to be able to say we tried. So if he won't cooperate, I want just straight reporting. How's he look? How's his cell look? Is he sketching, drawing? If he is, what's he sketching? Here's a uh, dossier on Lecter. Copy of our questionnaire and a special ID for you. I have your memo on my desk by 0800 Wednesday. OK. Um, excuse me, sir, but. Why the urgency? Lecter's been in prison for so many years now. Is there some connection between him and Buffalo Bill, maybe? I wish there were. I want your full attention, Starling. Yes, sir. Be very careful with Hannibal Lecter. Dr. Chilton at the asylum will go over all the physical procedures used with him. Do not deviate from them for any reason whatsoever. And you're to tell him nothing personal, Starling. Believe me, you don't want Hannibal Lecter inside your head. Just do your job, but never forget what he is. And what is that? Oh, he's a monster. A pure psychopath. So rare to capture one alive. From a research point of view, Lecter is our most prized asset. Well. You know, we get a lot of detectives here, but I must say I can't ever remember one as attractive. Will you be in Baltimore overnight? Because this can be quite a fun town if you have the right guide. <laughs> well, I'm sure this is 